Hey guys, Prepper Nurse One here. Um, make sure I got a smudge on this camera, so hold on. Let's see if I can clean that off. I think that's better. Sorry. Um, today, absolutely gorgeous day. Uh, high of 74 here in New York. Um, Heather and I actually went for a nice bike ride today. I just wanted to spend some family time with the kids today. We did do a little cleaning up. I uh, started picking stuff up out here. I will show you. Um, I got the, the three pallets out of here, and we cleaned this up, and we just got a bunch of um, scrap wood that was like too big for the uh, wood stove, and uh, just a bunch of leaves and stuff. We got all those burning up right now, so getting rid of that. Just trying, like I said, just trying to clean everything up, um, to, and we ended up, we were working inside the camper itself as well, and uh, guys, you want to say hello? You still have that same pink Floyd shirt on, don't you? Yeah. Go change right now. Everything, please. Say hi. How did you enjoy the ride today? It was great. You know we got lost. We did. We got lost. But uh, we ended up deciding to go and get some ice cream. So we uh, went to one place we knew, and they didn't have any that wasn't open yet. So we went to another place, which was... Uh, further out. So I said, well, let's go up this way. And it was absolutely gorgeous. We went by one of the lakes. We got a lot of finger lakes um, down here. So what do we put 130 miles on today? 32. Yeah, about 132 miles on today after I put 154 on yesterday. So in the last two days, I've ridden about 250 miles. Now you would say, oh my God, you got so much stuff to do there. You know, why are you out riding? Well, I hadn't had a chance to ride because the weather had been so crappy. And so because it's been nice, I've been out riding. So that's what I've been doing. Um, I will get back to doing more stuff tomorrow. Like I said, we did do a little cleanup today too, which I wanted to get done. I want to get this whole area cleaned up, straightened out. Um, I know I keep saying it, but I will be doing the uh, solar very soon. Now that the weather has turned and hopefully stays turned for us. Um, I did add bleach to the water tank, so um, that got done. And like I said, we started cleaning out the camper. I got uh, the windows open on the camper so we can get some fresh air after being... So we got them all opened up after being all bottled up all winter. Um, and like I said, it was just a nice day. It was just a chill day. Like I said, we did a little bit of work, which was good. And uh, so... Yeah, just working on cleaning things up now. Okay. You, you are, but I still love you. Anyway, um, I hope everybody had a good weekend. I really do. I hope you guys got to spend time with your families and your friends, whoever whoever's near and dear to you. Actually, that's who I hope you spend time with. Uh, one thing we're never getting back any of is time. So when the days are gone, they're gone. And, um, you know, Heather's in school all day. And, uh, you know, so I just wanted to spend some special time with her. And uh, so we did. And that was, you know, what I wanted to do. So that's what I did. I really, you know, I don't have to do something every day to, I mean, I want to try to get things done every day. Don't get me wrong. But I don't have to do something every day to feel productive. I felt productive doing what I did today. It was, like I said, it was spending that quality time. You know, like I said, time is what you can never get back. That's one of the things that I realized finally I wish I had realized it earlier in life, but, uh, you know, you go, you're chasing that golden ring when you're younger and, you know, you're sold this bill of goods that uh, you got to have the two cars and the big house and all that stuff to be successful. Well, that's not being successful. Being successful is being a positive influence on your children's lives and being there and being around as your children grow up and not being at work all the time and being happy. That's right. Now they're just saying being happy. And that's what it's about, realistically. That's that's what life is about, is, you know, leaving a mark that is a positive mark, not being a scumbag, um, you know. So, but, uh, so that's, you know, I mean, I hope everybody can find that inner peace and happiness. I really do. But uh, anyway, guys, listen, um, I am going to get off of here because we are going to go do some other stuff. And I think we're going to work inside the camper a little bit. I got a bunch of cleaning supplies for in there. And it really does need to be cleaned. So, you know, it's like a spring cleaning of everything and getting stuff out and, and, and stuff like that. So there's uh, plenty to do. 
keep us busy, that's for sure. But uh, we'll get there. And uh, I'm, I'm pretty psyched. I mean, I just, uh, um, I did call a real estate agent. Um, I told you guys, I, you know, contemplating moving down south. So what I did was I just wanted to kind of get an idea of what uh, the uh, cost would be for, um, or the price we could get for the property. So I called a real estate agent, and I'll probably hear back from her tomorrow. And, uh, you know, just kind of put some feelers out, see what we could get for this, and kind of go from there. And, uh, you know, one step at a time, you know. And if we decide to stay, we stay. If we decide to go, we'll go. Um, you know, it really kind of comes down to, you know, if, if they can put a good number on here, and I can get a good number on here, th then we might actually think about, you know, moving and, and doing it all over again. <laughs> But that's okay, you know what I mean? That's part of the adventure. But uh, I don't know. I mean, we'll we'll have to see. I mean, you know, we might stay another year and just keep working on stuff and, and do that too. I really don't know what we're going to do yet. So, like I said, just calling a real estate agent, doing that first step and trying to figure out what we can get for the property. Um, and then we go from there. All right. Well, listen, I am going to get off of here. I hope you guys have a wonderful day. As you can see, look at the clear, clear blue skies. And the freaking moon is out too. I think you can see that on there. Yep, there's the moon over. Let's see if I can't. Right there. There's the moon. So, um, it's beautiful. Beautiful, beautiful day. Absolutely awesome. So, guys, listen, have a great one. Um, I hope you all are doing well. And uh, remember, life is too short to be unhappy. And the only one in life that's going to hold you back is yourself. And follow your dreams. You know, really, truly follow your dreams. Have a great day. Prepper Nurse went out for now.